Theme song. Go, cunt! Right. The thing is, like, up is easier, but... Down is faster. Down is faster, yeah. So, like, that's, you know, you may want to, like, maybe hit a comfy middle, because, you know, you're gonna get fucking bum-jacked otherwise. Did you ever have those in primary school? Like, someone would come and go, hey, if Jack the Donkey helped you, would you help Jack the Donkey? Yes. Jack is probably one of my other favorite- Jesus, shit. I just- I lost all momentum. Yeah, I know. That's why I was- why I was saying Jesus shit, because he just ground to a fucking halt. Jack. Who wants a Jack? Bomb Jack then came out of that, and that's also just one of my other fucking faves. Bomb Jack. Made the game Mighty Bomb Jack incredibly fucking funny when we were in primary school. I fucking hate those walls. <laughs> so much. All right, I think the giant star holds the goal. So I fucking yeah, hit the hit the. Come on, come on. Oh, you are not gonna win this. Oh fuck yeah! <laughs> Look at that. I bet that little one's so pissed. Yeah, he's right to be. That's right. I'm the leader. Give me the star. Now get on the barbecue. <laughs> You look tasty. Your culture and society is stupid and your organizations are dumb. My star. Me star. Yeah. Mario star. I'm taking your gold because you don't know how to use it. I'm going back to Spain. <laughs> and I'm gonna throw it at a fucking woman and hope she doesn't kill me. Is that the road to El Dorado? Um, Sounds like it. Well, no, that's just that's just history. Okay. <laughs> that's just Spain went to South America. Like, ah, I'm your gold. A glorious city. Was built by the divinities. But, oh shit, we brought a bird back. The fuck are we getting harassed by refugees? This is Noah's Ark. It's actually an end times game. <laughs> like, these worlds are slowly destroying, and we're just yeah. saving the species. Except, you know, instead of taking two as the logical thing, we're taking one to interbreed them to make a massive super species. <laughs> I wanna see that. <laughs> Fucking. Now, fuck! Now, root! He just like pushes them together. Alright, can I just jump between. Yes, thank you. <sighs> thank the Jeebus. Alright, boss time. Who's gonna be this one? Bowser, Bowser Jr., Bowser Sr., Steve Dave. Bowser's Gravity Gauntlet. Steve Dave. Oh, yo, I'm Steve Dave. Welcome to. Oh, I'm Steve. That was one of my absolute favorites. I. Morrights is my favorite fucking. What's his name? Fat cunt. Silent Bob. Kevin, St Kevin yeah. Smith. He's lost some weight. I remember one time he was complaining about being so big he couldn't wipe his ass properly. Oh, now. dude. Yeah. I didn't ever think he was that bad. It, right. got, it got really bad for a bit. Like, he threw a tantrum because an airplane said he was too fat to sit in the seat. <laughs> and it's like, dude, that's not the plane's fault. When you're arguing with a plane about you fitting on it, that's a you issue. Like, and I'm a big cunt. Like, I don't fit on public transport. I don't blame fucking chairs, because I know that most people aren't my goddamn size. Yeah. So, you know, if you're that big because you, like, fucking love cheeseburgers and self-fucking-loathing, like, then it's on you. Not good. Not good. Get, get, Not a, bit good. Brave, get a bit fucking brave there, Aaron. You know, you need to steady on there. Fortune favors the world, get. Yeah, that's true. So like Kevin Smith. Fuck you! Into the lava with your PlayStation. Fucking wizard coopers. Fucking weird boys. Oh, well, oh, look nice. at that. still got it. Fucking tickle it with your tank. Yeah. Tank tickle love. Huh. Oh, fucking the control should have kept going <laughs> and they didn't. Gravity squeeze. Right now I'm up there. That kind of helped me. Yeah, that was, that was useful. And you got, yeah, you got back, so, you know, no loss. <laughs> you know what? No. <laughs> I ain't having any of that. I'm just, I'm not tempted. I'm not interested at all. Out of the water. Here comes Mario. Yippee yo, yippee yay! Out of the water and into the steaming ladle. That's how you kill giant sentient bricks. I love the uh, uh, noise. Alright, you don't want to do that because you're going to fucking die. So good. 
fucking, you know, I'm old Russian ladies tell I'm stories about behavior like destiny. that to warn against fucking impudence and imprudence. Fucking flip controls on me. Oh, it's doing it again. Oh, come on, don't. F mm. <laughs> Hmm. Okay. Oh. We go around the wheel of doom. Yeah, you really just want to kill Kid Cooper at this point. <coughs> oh yeah, this again, reminding you how to beat the boss. Good you think we got these regenerating orbs. I know, it's like... Having a giant fucking safe and then putting the key and the code on the ground in front of it. I hope no, I hope no one uses these. <laughs> mm. What do they do? Exclusively open this door. Wish I could traverse black holes. Things live in the rift. This is exactly the same as the last one, Mario. <laughs> Why are you looking scared? I wonder who it could be this time. Because Bowser's not there. Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. You were around somewhere, my other. Right, it's you. That's my heart, Nemesis. Your time is up, Mario. Okay, yeah. Now it's solution time. Time for my huge fist to meet you up here in the face. I like, I like Al Jolson, but also that just makes sense. <laughs> just makes sense. No! Scooby Doo, my fuck. I can't do it because my voice box will explode. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fucking great voice. Oh, oh fuck. He's got rings! He's learnt fucking Power Wave from Terry Bogo. Power Wave! Power Wave! I almost called him fucking Terry Geyser. <laughs> <laughs> Power Geyser is his super move. Oh, those make uh, rings yeah, too? Alright, everything, everything makes rings. Everything is rings. Nothing but rings. Get him in the ring. Oh. <laughs> ring, ring around the rosy, a pocket full of faggots. Uh oh, I don't know how that didn't hit me, but no, magic. No. All right, they're re that's really tight. Like. Stay near the fucking balls. Like you're running way too far away from. You gotta run away because otherwise no, I don't, you I don't kill them. Yeah, but like you're literally crossing the other fucking side. You'll drop two, so you gotta like yeah like. Now yeah, he'll stop there. Now get to that one. Yeah, now pop up under the floor. Oh, fucking get it. Yeah, you just stop shooting planets at me. It would be swell. Yeah. I wish you could run up and punch him like Kratos did to fucking Kronos. You know? That would be cool. That's all right. I'm good. Yippee yo! Oh. Yippee yay! Fucking right in the fucking face. <laughs> It's re- OH SHIT! Hang on, I'm prepared. Fuck my butt. Nice. I need a coin. Lava, lava, lava. Hot things, lizard. Hot things. Psycho power lasers. Meet your demise! That's right. Uh, now I'm gonna eat you. Yeah. Oh, he's still pretty big, though. Yeah. In the end, he's a giant dragon Koopa. Just fucking eat him, he's a human. <laughs> Isn't that one of the Mario RPGs when you tell me? Yeah, yeah, you, Bowser's inside story. You go inside him. 
Finally, a Mario game based on my inner space fanfiction. Yeah. You play the game as Bowser, and it switches to Mario and Luigi inside, to who, like, do different things inside and get past different obstacles and stuff. Is that 3DS cool. one? Yeah. Hopefully I'm not going to die. Hoping on 3DS, virtual console and stuff for the new Nintendo Switch. Although, hoping on any virtual console <laughs> stuff for the new Nintendo Switch. Nintendo Switch, it comes with an egg. Why? We don't know. Yes. A Nintendo egg. Like, you know, the more you hear about what's actually happening at release, the more it feels like maybe they, wasn't, they weren't fucking done. So I said, what the fuck have you been doing? It's, it's exactly what the dude said. It's a soft release. They're gonna... The, the, all the big shit's gonna come in November. It's just to cash in on people getting the hype early in Zelda. Like, that's literally it. It won't be a full console until later in the year. Yeah. Well, I mean, the online's not even gonna be there until fucking Mario Kart 8 shows up. You fought that Bowser monster again? I don't know why he's doing that voice. Like, before, it was sort of like a weird Pee Wee Herman voice. Yeah, I, I think that voice suits him more, because he's... <clears throat> look at those pants. You need to stop Bowser before it gets a little powerful. Oh, well, that dude, sounds like it. someone I'm holding Pee Wee really hard. <laughs> you know, yeah, like just two really buff dudes hugging him because they he saved the gym. Is that the word of the day? <laughs> it's a weird thing. Pee -wee. <laughs> like it wasn't until 2005 that I believe that fucking Pee Wee's Playhouse was an actual kids show and not a mock kids show for mm. adults. This place would look like a bit of a rubber ticket. But to remove a ride out of the enemy's home base, why do you see we're dropping down on the house? Maybe the bad one knows next to us when we still up. I'm <laughs> fat. We're going to go into a rock and we're going to take its oil. The game has been saved. Space Storm Galaxy. Oh, that sounds cool. Yeah. Star Fox cameos. No, a power roll. Jeez Louise, I've been saved by Fox! <laughs> Fucking slippy. Time operation, find out what gender it is. It's peeing in the break room! Repeat, it's peeing in the break room! <laughs> yes. Pronouns a break and break self. Uh, there's a little wiggy. Not fuck the wee. Yeah. He, he's earned. Nothing but disdain. The spring, the spring issue brought a lot of things to fucking home roost. This is what happens when you launch amateur rockets into space without checking like flight paths and shit. Especially these flight paths for Italians. This is interesting. This is Nikola Tesla's penis. <laughs> Which I he, don't believe that. He never once used. Uh, yeah. yeah. It turns out the fucking people that internet lo nerds love was really weird about sex. Huh. <laughs> you see, women will drain his brain electricity. And sap him of his precious bodily fluids. And make him stupid. And I'm able to continue sending soggy envelopes of semen to Edison. Which he did, that's an actual true history fact. No. <laughs> I, I would like people to believe that. Nikola Tesla's used to mail soggy envelopes of semen to uh, Thomas Edison. Edison fed the entire contents to his hamsters. Yes. I haven't seen any bombs. Monita's brother, Bronita. <laughs> Bronita. Oh, there's one down there. Oh, okay. I get it. I'd use it to kill a Luma. <laughs> Luma, Luma. Luma, 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 Luma! I can't believe oh, fucking Jesus, dude. Didn't you didn't you listen to the fucking Monita fucking Obviously presentation? Not. You gotta go closer to him. I'm in your pipe, touching your dudes. Fuck yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Tesla tickle in your innocence. <laughs> My recorder! Play hot cross buns. No! It's the only thing I know! Shut up! Throw it, throw it! There's a little spinnies fucking hitting you. What are those? Oh, you got a fucking bomb that cunt. Bombs over bad guys. Kaboom! Kablamo! Excuse me, dear. Supposed to be a moot shattering the boom. Fuck. That was just odd. Was it, Aaron? Was it? Yeah. It was perfectly in character. No. I think it was discovered over the years. The time it goes, you know, you know, just snatch defeat from the jaws of victory. I'll just jump into a black hole, it sounds like. I'll jump into a black hole, fuck you. Forget most. Oh, butterscotch. Exactly. Always my shawl makes when shaking it off after a thief. Yeah. Oh, hot biscuits. Oh, oh, oh. Well, follow me, you are. Come on! Really? <laughs> you shit out. That's a load of shit. Cause I'm watching it and it's like, cause I do the same thing where it's like, okay, you could be patient and succeed, or I could finish the stage right now. <laughs> yeah, that's the best choice. The reckless yeah. answer is always the best answer. Fucking straight away, we're gonna get this done. Like, yeah. like, is that gonna fire? Yeah, we could yeah. hang on a second, but we could beat it. Yeah, we fucking race get the train. Oh, look at that. Okay. Race the fucking train. It paid off. It might be following me, but yeah, I don't to, care. You need to fucking you need to surf these things. Don't pause, man. You gotta fucking just grip and rip. That's it. That's it. Taking two at a time. Yeah, that's what you gotta do. Come on, come on, come on. See, it didn't do that last time. He just went through it. <sighs> Cause all sorts of Angle shenanigans. Was a bit tight. Fucking cut. No, 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 no. Wasn't it fucking Royal Rumble? I don't even fucking. I'm barely. I'm just out of the WWE at the moment. The WWP. Yeah. I could sit and watch something that makes me angry, or I could go watch fucking New Japan and actually enjoy wrestling again. No, oh, that looks fun. Not. Also, stardom. Because it's adorable little wrestle girls what? who then do fucking strong style combos on each other's heads. <laughs> Watching women terrifies me. Dude, like, seriously, some of the fucking most nasty, dangerous, don't do that looking fucking suplexes come out of those fucking stardom chicks. Like, Mayu Watani can, like, fucking stretch in ways that don't make sense. And she just, there's this real good, there's a gif of it floating about where she she's, like, holding a girl up quite high. Mm. And then she's struggling, because they, they sort of, like, you know, fight each other in order to get into finishing positions and shit. And then she, like, lets go to, like, block the struggle. Fucking catches him into a dragon suplex, and then, as she does it, falls down to her own knees. But because her fucking back's so flexible, can still do this back arc, and it just winds up dumping this poor other girl onto her goddamn brain. And, you know, women weigh like 8 kilos, so it folds them up, <laughs> but it like, doesn't, you know, none of them are fucking crippled for life, or like, you know, wind up Benoit. We have ridden Shai Halud. Fucking, you that was, that was literally, literally ran after that. It made me go faster. I'm boosting. It's a strategy. See, I'll grab this one. Yeah, this is a this and then is I'll, a, I'll pick up the point. See, now, yeah. now I'm faster. Like, look at that. It's all part of the strategy. Top of the penis. You just, you, YouTubers, you're just not as good as me. You're not, you're not embracing that damage. You gotta, yeah. You gotta ride it. That's what speedruns are about, man. You know about like life. Like, like these ones aren't damage boosting because they won't boost you. You just get hit and be like, ah, oh, fuck. What the fuck is that? That chicken looks upset. <laughs> Pooping bombs! I'd yeah, be upset that's, too. That's legit you after tacos. Nah, not tacos. Tacos are fine. It's, um, shit. Every, that was a bad choice. You have some amazing luck when it comes to, like, shit hitting you and then nudging you right at the fucking edge. It's not tacos. Tacos I have no problem with. It is, um, anything that's sort of like curry but not. Like, I have no problem with curry, but things that What's are. What's like curry but not? I don't even know. Just other spicy sort other of curry. Things. Yeah. <laughs> Goulash! I don't fucking 
Pretty much every food is just like fucking curry. It's just a stew yeah. with different spices. Like, what do you put in it? Meat and Nothing fucking really, no, stops my shit. stomach and comes out bad. Except for those fucking, um, like, chicken wings we had. Pickled jalapenos. I fucking well. love pickled jalapenos, but they, I don't, I, my body just doesn't seem to digest them at all, so I just wind up shitting horrible raw pickled jalapenos that fucking have basically scarred my asshole. I, it looks like dark, man. I think a scarred asshole is not fun. Yeah, like, it's amazing because the face and other parts of you can get used to, like, chili, but I swear your bum doesn't. Fucking, <laughs> <laughs> it's so bad. And I don't care, but I still really fucking love pickled jalapenos. Like, that's one of those fucking things where if I buy a jar room, I'm not allowed to have the jar out for any extended period, because <laughs> I'll just, like, I have to, like, do what I'm doing with it straight away and then put it away. I love this gear. So good. Sorry. You will not crush me. Oh, my spirit. Ow, my spirit. Damn, Japanese. Healthy Japs. Oh, shit. See, now he's sliding his butt. I'm happy now. That's got a, that's got a sting. Holy shit. They look Why happy. are you smiling? This is not funny. They have come to crush your soul. Yeah. We're taking you to the afterlife. They'll be singing. Dancing. Oh, too hard left. Too hard left. Alright, I didn't expect him to... Fall off during the jump. They're gonna mummify Luigi, so we'll be there for you in the <laughs> afterlife. It's like struggling. Like. <laughs> no! I'm alive! I like how he sounds more and more like a goat. Meh. <laughs> hey, it's Luigi. Meh. That's about the time no. I always bought a goat. Yes. I was, I'm the one who convinced you it was probably not a good idea. Yeah. Well, you told me about the way they eat the root of the fucking grass, yeah. so that wasn't even, wasn't even solving the fucking problem. But it's criminal how easy it is to get a goat. Like, it's fucking nothing. Like, people, places will lose. Whoa, what the fuck? They're speeding up, chum. You gotta get, you know, now we're in fucking F-Zero territory. Like, with very few questions asked, places in Australia will deliver a goat to your door for like 40 bucks. Yeah. And that doesn't seem right. For $80, I can get a cow. And if provided I only have one cow, it doesn't count as, like, fucking livestock rules, so I can just have it in the backyard. Oh, yeah, we're getting fucking tight around here in there. Which is tempting. Like, if I was, like, a proper house husband, I'd, I'd start buying cow and shit. Uh, yeah, get in there. Get in there? Yeah. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> Probably, you know, I might reevaluate these It's a boost! Like, oh, shit! Ugh. I knew that guy. <laughs> it looks like after taking acid. I don't want to cross the pattern all the Steve machine. Ah. Alright, that's my chili either. Yeah. It's funny fucking. One of the, the, the jokes on Scrubs always kills me is when they say Elliot looks like Steve Buscemi. <laughs> Didn't they have him in an episode? Yeah. Cause that She's like, I look like Steve Buscemi, and then she's like, that's not true. And then she's like, see Elliot? Turn, I'm over here. And it is literally Steve Buscemi. And he goes, well, that's weird. I use those to massage my back. Right. Run out of batteries or something? Ran out of waggle! You fool. I don't think I Fucking can... whip it properly, not fucking there, see? I think it's, I, I lift it up higher, because I think the fucking detector has to see it. I'm tired of looking at this thing, and you, like, you have to faster. Like, Dude, oh. I fucking... No, I don't, like, as in, give it a bit more fucking range, you know? Oh, 
Oh shit. Man, he's got cannons! Cannon chicken. Go, 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 go. I love chili! Oh. <laughs> That was a stupid boss. That was bad design, Nintendo. I hear that thing's gonna take over for Ellen DeGeneres when she retires. <laughs> oh, it's got more personality. Just a mean midday talk show. <laughs> yeah, that's something about those shows, like the, the fucking. Because Oprah was basically Springer for a while. Like, she hosted Ghetto fucking cousin fucking shit. Mm. And then she got all kind of like dull, and then she got insanely rich and started giving people cars and houses and shit. And Ellen was reasonably funny, like some of her stand up, like from like ages ago and shit, when she was allowed to be sort of mean and weird. It was reasonably good. I mean, she does do odd shit still, which I think is kind of like lingering elements of her stand up thing. Like when she has those weird games where she has women in blindfold yeah. guys painted on them, fucking you know, stumble about groping each other and shit. I think she's been talking to Yoko. <laughs> Nobody should talk to you. <laughs> you fucking Chuck Berry's eyes. Just it is. It internal is, screaming yeah. is the best. It is really. It's internal screaming. It's just like, ah! <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? You said she was cool. She ain't cool. She ain't cool. Oh, gingerbread. Walk on the weird side. All right. Well, fucking. <laughs> All right. What coins even do for me? Hundreds of life still. No. Black hole. Black hole is racist. You know, like that, I saw a guy actually yelling about that on the news one time. Oh, the black holes were racist. Yeah, someone referred to it was it was like it was a town hall meeting lunatic though, and those are like the absolute. Peak of fucking insane human beings. And like, someone referred to like, you know, council spending as something on something as a black hole. I and mean, then he, he got upset because he thought it was something to do with like, I don't know, throwing money at blacks or something. Like that. <laughs> that makes sense. It does not. But again, the people who go to these fucking meetings are some of the most, like, just generally, you know. Because there's nothing going on at these fucking things, and they're just fucking sub omegaloids. Like, as well, it's because I'm a fucking connoisseur of these creatures, because so rarely do you get to see them, you know, without having to actually, mm. you know, be, just find one on, on, like, the bus or something. And that's a hassle. But, like, and there's no reason, like, you can't just look up, you know, dipshit or something like that. Because you just, you know, you just get... Too results. Yeah, and you get a lot of people's opinions about what a dipshit is, which is usually a bit of a mess. And what the fuck are those little things doing? No, they're trying to eat me. Little bastards. It's the rhythm. Like there, there are some absolutely cosmic here ones. Like there's a woman from uh, I think it's like Kentucky or some shit. Like. Uh, talking about a gay ordinance, and it starts out with her explaining about Winter Wipeout. Huh. Like the TV show, you know, where they fucking throw people around on, like, soft surfaces with, like, fucking, you know, water and shit. Yeah. And how that's, like, a gay plan to watch people suffer. Um, Amazing. And it, it just gets crazy. And there's another great one where I don't even know what the fuck it's about. Like, it's so hard to even, like, work out what the, no. the maniac's actual concerns are. There's one with this woman going on about how she has like six butts, not six boobs. It's a, no, like I'll find it. Like I, I've saved heaps of these because I just and they're amazing because they will they will talk for as long as they possibly can. Mm. And it is the absolute best beat poetry. Like you just load one of them up in one YouTube window and then you bring another one up of like just ten minutes of smooth jazz and you just put them both on. And you just like you know, dun, 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 dun. winter wipeout encourages homosexual <laughs> genociders. It's fantastic. It is fucking marvelous. Like only the truly mad can be decent fucking poets. Everyone who tries poetry fucking sucks at it. But like people with Wernicke's aphasia and shit like that, 
fucking stellar. Oh, she's hard, bro. I still know Poetry's where my tuba boys hard. are at. 